hear us, for our name is Kyle It's really hard to pronounce Kyle these days. Kyle the alien. Kyle the- we are Kyle the alien! It's me, Kyle. Hi, Kyle. Where are you from? This is Kyle the alien. Oh, I've never heard of it. Understandable. It's on the other side of the third galaxy nearby. How many- arms do you have? Why does everybody ask me that question? Because you seem like you've got a lot of arms, Kyle. I have a regular amount of arms for my people. Wait, Colin, Colin, Colin. Yes? Don't panic. Okay. I oh. think you have a giant bug on your arm. I know I put it there. Why would you do that? He looks like he sees you. Yeah, I'd hope so. He, he does have eyes for a reason. Are you his papa? Uh, I mean, I, I suppose you could say that. By which I mean yes. What, what's he called? Glorp. See, I thought maybe this it's was gonna come full circle and you were gonna tell me he's Kyle the alien. No, this this is Glorp. I like I like Beatles. Beatles are cool. What's your favorite Beatle? Don't 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 do it. I just I know what you're gonna do and I I, I want you to genuinely tell me your favorite Beatle. Glorp is my favorite. <laughs> You really wanted to name a band member, didn't you? No, I was going to say Dung Beetle, but I, I didn't think you wanted that. Oh, no, you're allowed to say Dung Beetle. Dung Beetles are cool. Okay, uh, Dung Beetle. Industrial, uh, industrious little shit balls. <laughs> it's really an industry of shit balls. Little shit balls, specifically. <laughs> Talking of shit balls, that's what we'll be saying when we see our next challenge, because he's a mighty foe! Perfect time for me to try a new weapon. Yay, I do see that you are insect glaving it up. No, Glorp is just here for fun. I also really like the Nigerella Insect Glaive. It's a very, yeah, it's right? a very it's so sensual cool. weapon right it there. Is. It looks at you and it looks deep into your soul. Sorry, it's a very sensual weapon right there. Don't just wave at me, High Questatrix, like I'm not going to probably my death. It's like, hey, good luck, good luck with that. <laughs> look how soft my hand is. I use moisturizing cream. I may have read into some subtext. I just, I got some dry hands, man. I just want some, want some moisturizer. <laughs> hey, man, very cool. You all right? You're just gonna watch me. My turn. <laughs> you know there's other seats, right? I know this one's warm. I want my seats like I want my tea. Pretty warm. That makes it sound weird. I want my hunt like I want my tea. Right now. I actually do have a cup of tea right now. <sighs> Did you enjoy that? I mean, I didn't drink the tea, but I, the concept was nice. Did you vicariously enjoy drinking the tea through me? Well, I'm not a fan of tea personally, so I- What? I just don't like warm drinks for the most part. That made me hoarse, man! That's how much that upset me! Well, you should have some more tea if you're going a bit hoarse. Oh, look, it's a spiky rock bush behind us! Yeah, that could be that could be nothing. Uh, there's no way I could have any idea what That could be nothing. I'm sure that's nothing at all. Wait a minute. The ground is... Alive! And your feet are pointy. Don't you just hate it? Also, this is a cutscene with both of us. Yeah, because the Cantar is guild, so cutscene guild. I didn't know there were multiplayer cutscenes in, in Guild Quest. Yeah, not that this is a Kantar. It could be anything. Could be anything. Could be anything. Also, what happened in World if there were multiplayer cutscenes in Guild and for you? <laughs> Look, all right. Oh, God, that's so cool. That's very cool. Are you all right down there? I'm up here. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm bleeding out my ears. I can't hear a goddamn thing. Well, as long as it's just me. Why do I get to start down in the lava death pledge pool area? Well, I mean, whose fault is I should have a cool drink? You should. I don't have cool drinks. Oh, uh, for ultimate Akanto, my friend, here we go. Ingliling it. Put your insects in his mouth. That will be the plan when he stops moving so much. Behold, yea, verily, for I will play my horn of doom on- Ow! Okay, okay, look, um- Akanto, buddy. Yay, Verily. I know you're not a fan of the horn, but this will help the situation and give you a more glorious battle, okay? We just all just have a moment and... I bet you didn't even know a horn could sound like that, did you? No. <laughs> well, I put special ingredients in my horn. Ooh, look at you with your horn ingredients. It's turtles, mate. Oh, yeah, I mean, that's a weird ingredient name, but I can respect it <laughs> <as> a concept. <laughs> That's a really bad, like, fragrance! Turtles mating by Chanel. I don't actually know if Chanel's a brand. I just kind of said a brand sounding name. It's a brand of something. It does feel like a brand of something, doesn't it? My insect is, my kid insect is very slow. Glorp is, is not helping. How are you enjoying Far Ultimate Insect Glove? Well, I've not really used it yet. I've just been shooting a kinsect at it repeatedly, and it's not been helping. <laughs> I've just been smacking my beetle against him, and well, I'm, just, I want I'm not sure buff, it's doing a lot for us. My insect is really slow. <laughs> 
look, just keep trying your best, man, and it will be fine. That's, that's orange. I found an orange. Now all you need is the six other mighty fruits to complete your collection and unlock your true powers. That's me, collection of powers, man. <laughs> so late! It's not a great name, is it? Collection of powers, man! Ow. He yelled, and then the ground he yelled, yelled back, loud. and I got caught in the Akantor ground domestic. It's an interesting name for it. Oh, in case you're wondering, and I'm sure you are, because obviously you care, my favorite beetle is the Goliath beetle. Understandable, really. Because it's really brown. It's, okay, that's an interesting reason, but under I guess I can deal with that. Did you think I was going to say something silly, like, because it's really big? I mean, that's less silly, I think. <laughs> no, it is because it's really big. They're really cool. <laughs> oh, God, he's orange! Well, I don't have orange buff, so I don't believe you. <laughs> He's lying to me. I've tried so hard to get orange buff out of this Akantor. I do love a good classic flying wyvern hunt, you know? Yeah. I love when they start flying. I mean, if Akantor could hover, we'd, we'd be in a lot of bother. Yeah, I don't think it would be good for us if he did. I can confirm that. <laughs> Actually, no, he should be able to hover, but kind of really uselessly. Just like a couple inches really slowly. The insect just flinched him. You just flinched him with a insect. Are you kidding me? Fucking warp his ass. <laughs> Please, never, and I cannot implore this enough or emphasize it more. Utter the phrase, glorp his ass again. Thank you. I think it was accurate to the situation, though. Oh. I'm just being tossed around a bit health-wise here. I'm struggling. It doesn't help that I don't have a cool drink, because I didn't know we were coming here, and I thought my items had had one, but it just didn't. Look, I don't think we do. How? What? That oh. was all of my health. That was just all of my health. I just said I don't think we're doing bad, and then it's like you had to spite me by dying. Well, that's unfortunate, but maybe you should have tried helping me somehow. It's because I sounded like a choking fish, isn't it? You're, you you held that against me. Yes. Drowning fish are really funny. If you say so. No, because they drown in air, man. That's like the reverse of a normal drowning. It's crazy. Oh, it's the reverse of human drowning. It, it makes sense for things that don't breathe air. It's the reverse of all land drowning. Yes, because they don't breathe air. I love for you, okay. Akanto. I love his little, like, fuse line when he digs towards you, so you can kind of get a feel for where he is. Yeah, it's, it's nice to have a directional indication. I can't remember if, if Goo does that or not. I really can't. I don't remember him having much of an indication. Big hit face? Yeah, big hit face! I broke a tusk! You get him, Glorp. Come on. This was you and me together. We did this. Thank you, Glorp. <laughs> just see you behind him, just like, swoosh, swoosh, yeah, insect life movements. Without actually like doing anything, of, have you have you maligned the Akantor yet? Yes, yes, I have. Thank you. Okay, okay, all right. I will give you the horn of my people. Thank you. Do you feel empowered? Uh, conceptually, yes. Good. What about figuratively? Oh, he's going far away. That doesn't mean good thing. Oh, big beam, big beam, big big raw, big volume, big loud. Here we go. It's the dub wub blast. The dub blast. God, he's so cool. I will never not love Mr. Black God. Like, he's just the best. Look at him. Yeah, he's great. God, fuck you, can Yeah, honestly. Oh, disagree, but you, you, you look your mic. <laughs> I love that we have a different favorite of the pair. It's very apt. Yeah, one of them's correct and one of them's not. Yeah, you're wrong. Disagree. Okay, everybody, but a cancer or you can list. Okay, let battle commence. I want that comment section to be a bloodbath. It's not a fight we're talking about. But like you have a snow-based animal with a with right. a janky ass chin versus the, the it's made not janky. For it's war. a shovel because he's a snow-based like, animal. He's made for what? Like a cantor can bite a gravios in half, man. And you're over here like, yeah, he totally, he totally struggle against against his, something care. he counters. Come on! I didn't say he would struggle. This isn't a fight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but surely a point to a cantor for being the more powerful creature in the argument of which is best. No, that's not that's not what best is described as when talking about which one is better as a monster. Best can be whatever your definition is, whatever makes sense for you, you know? Yeah, and your definition seems to be whatever works for you getting your monster an extra point. Look, all right, even if we ignore the monster themselves, Akanto aesthetically isn't much cooler than you can loss. His tusky face is much cooler than good old shovel chin. I don't agree. No, I like the shovel chin. Yeah, because you like weird stuff. Like, I don't, you're not gonna get me to agree with that. Like, his has a use. A cantor just has a, a big chin with His dust. use is puncturing armor and killing things. Well, that's unfortunate because there's other things you can do with life. <laughs>
And a cantor is a much more like Ugh! name than you can laws. Okay, this isn't about the name. It's all a factor. What? What? Why are you restricting the categories with what matters? I'm not. Here? I'm just saying that you're just picking things that are completely irrelevant to what we normally talk about. You're like name doesn't matter, law doesn't matter. It's just aesthetic. No, Lord, the Lord does matter. I didn't say Lord didn't matter. You didn't say Lord doesn't matter because no, you don't care that a cantor would totally take your can laws. That's not law. That's power. That is. Oh, that is the lore of which one is the strongest superior being that's not in the Monster Hunter world. Lore is in ecology, as in which one has a cooler concept of what makes them an actual monster within the world. Not lore is in which one is stronger in a fight against each other. <laughs> They're both aspects of law. Okay, thank you very much. I don't think so. I think that's a completely separate topic of discussion. And hey, Akanto's lore is cooler, because he's actually a nomad that seeks things out and... and and explores and destroys villages. You kind of just lives in his little icy cave all lonely. Yeah, and I like monsters that don't just like run around killing shit for fun. He doesn't kill shit for fun. He kills it shit for dominance. Because he likes killing shit. Well, he's got to remind people that he's to be feared. Did we just get a paralysis? Yes, I'm using natural and sick life. Well done. Thank you. Are you enjoying it? Fun? Look, I'll be honest with you. I am slightly devil's appling. I, I think they're both 10 out of 10 monsters. I know. I'm mounting him. Why are we flipping it? Oh, you're mounting him. Go on. Go on, son. Unfortunately, I have very little stamina. Go on. Go on, lad. I have way too little stamina. Oh, I have way too little stamina for this. I believe. Oh, but it's going to be enough. Yeah. Yes. Insects. Well done. I'm so proud Thank of you. you. Did you just yell insects as you got off the monster? I sure did. Ah, uh, you know what? That's fair enough. It was through their power that we got that mount. I think it's only right that insect glaive players do get to yell regularly. Insect! Okay, we're not far from failing this because I have no health and very little healing opportunities. On the condition that they do promise to enunciate very clearly every time they yell it. No promises. You, did you raid the item box for goodies when you when you got up here? Not much, no. Well, that's a huge mistake, isn't it? I got cool drinks because I needed them, and I was in the middle of healing when I died, so it wasn't that that killed me there. Self-styled ruler. <laughs> what a name for a cantor's introduction. Yeah, you know, I, I'm somewhat of a self-starter. Uh, fancied myself a bit of a king, and, you know, I just went out and grabbed what I wanted from life. You know, I really appreciate you doing this documentary on me, and... Why I'm so much better than uh, you can uh, uh, can lose. We didn't have a choice. You threatened to kill us. You know, you don't, don't put that in, though. All right, I I want that little snow bastard to be jealous. You don't actually have an issue with him, lore wise. <laughs> yeah, I'll eat you. Nope. Oh, I love that little dolphin dive. Though maybe calling him a dolphin is quite offensive. Yeah, I don't know if I would call him a dolphin. It doesn't seem accurate to me. I mean, a dolphin with spikes would be a fearsome sight. It would be. Especially considering dolphins are dicks. <laughs> you said I had some personal dolphin beef there. Well, yeah, they're anti-bug. Dolphins are unto themselves. Like, they antagonize pufferfish to get high on the toxin. I mean, that's just some next-level dolphining. Relatable, really. Inflatable or relatable? Why not both? Okay. That's a relatable inflatable. The relatable inflatable. It's like balloons. I relate to balloons. I also relate to balloons, you know? Happy, floating, free, but at a moment's notice, you can pop and come crashing down. Yeah, that's life, isn't it? Who'd win in a charge fight? Tigrex or a Cantor? Probably a Cantor, because he would, like, trample him. <laughs> Why, you underestimate that. No, it would be. It would be. It would be a Cantor. Go, Cotton, you're the best. Go, Cotton, you can kill. Kill him harder. Aww. Oh! Aww. Sorry. Oh, God, yeah, his sound beam dragon blights you of all things. It's so random. I can't goddamn see half of his attacks because the camera's too zoomed in. Is there settings for this? I am enjoying you bringing paralysis to the table. Right? Very enjoyable situation. Well, I mean, I am in Monster Hunter. I hate it when you bring paralysis to the table in real life. Well, yeah, I mean, it's a bit weird then. It's like, why are you doing that, man? Oh, there's a mount. Here we go again. The insect glaive just don't stop till the monster drops. Well, the last one didn't count because it didn't happen. <laughs> the last one didn't. Count. I'm helping you. Oh, you just... Okay, you knocked me... That's what happened, I think. Yes. You knocked him over, so it just ended my mount. No, 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 because I will contribute when you contribute to the mount, so it will have pushed it to the end for you. Well, the bar wasn't going up. It just fell over, and then it kicked me off, and I didn't get to take part in the mount down. Interesting. Maybe it wasn't till Goo that they added that? It's hard to tell sometimes. Oh, the tail. I forgot the tail was part of that. It's been a while since I fought in the Cantor. I wonder when they'll bring back the gods. I will be shocked if they're not in Monster Hunter 6. Should be 6th gen, right? Yeah, at least no. Like, imagine a, 
like a Matsu quality, a Fatalis quality, white god, black god. Like, imagine how good you could make these monsters. Well, the thing is, that couldn't be part of a title update at that point, because it's the two of them and they'd have to come together. There's no way they'd do both in one title update. It would have to be part of the base game. No, that would be a great update. The, the White Black God, like both of them. But imagine the amount of, like, that's multiple title updates of work in one title update. That just sounds insane. Yeah, but they share skeletons and similar movesets, so they're, they're kind of cross pollinating so that's efficient. Go, Cotton, you will succeed. You can do this. Learn to read. It's really hard not to be able to read. Like, do you know how hard it is to accept quests when you don't know what you're accepting? I want that one. Which one? I want Another man. that one. Do it again! Do it again! Knock him over! Maybe I'll get this one. Look at you up there on his little spike. Why does he even care? You're like... I'm having fun. I'm just on the one spike. I'm stabbing his one armored You're spike. You're like stabbing his toenail equivalent. Like, what, what does he care at all? And it's over again. It's just kicking me off halfway through. Are you staggering? It's a stagger thing. You're 100% staggering while I'm up there. Yeah, I think I am just flinching him, and then it then it means no mount for you. I, I think you should stop attacking him while I'm mounting and just wait for the mount down. Yeah, that might be a good call. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm buried. I am buried in the floor here. He lies, Conan. Tried his best. I am gone. He's not kidding with his expediency in the process. Like, he kills you and buries you in the same animation. <laughs> he kills you and buries you in the... Get supplies, get health, get stuff before you jump back down. Yeah, yeah that's, that, that's the plan. Uh, he kills you and buries you in the same animation. It's really rough. <laughs> really like entrenched there that was quite good <laughs> rise a cantor from the depths rise a cantor you are next god the multifaceted power of this horn is quite grand so you have a, a lot of horn going on there well it's important that you can do many things with your with your average horn <laughs> okay that's enough of that that's enough of that I think we heal, Cotton. I think we do a little, a little heal. Oh, shit. That would be ideal. Oh, no. Defense down and get hit by charge. It goes very dead hunter. It's not good, no. Please survive. I'll try. We should really bring, bring the item and see it to the hunt. Yeah, that'd be helpful. And then we not get one shot by, by the Cantor. I don't know why you're talking like this, but it concerns I me I don't greatly. know either. It just brings me comfort. I, I feel like it should stop sooner rather than later. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, you get to look like you've got like super powered aura around you. I do, it's my extraction. It's actually really cool looking. It's a shame that's not a thing anymore. I guess they decided it was a bit too much. It's awesome though. <laughs> what? I'm gonna die to the first tick of this fire when I stand up. Aww. He just baited me. He turned to face you, cancelled, then rotated back to face me, and then blasted me mid-air with a beam because I couldn't get off the ledge in time. For me, he would he didn't face me at all. <laughs> no, you're right. I was just making it up. Your veiny arms, we will kill you. Oh my god. That's an awkward landing position. I didn't know that was where you come in, or I would have said something. Killing time. <laughs> that was huh? so my ah uh, ah uh, how did that flinch him it was just a little circle sweep against his tail after blocking the rock oh he's going all the way yeah it does look like it doesn't it jesus christ oh i'm not gonna get anywhere near him before he starts powering up this uh... <laughs> i was just like i need to paralyze or mount him before he beams <laughs> you to death and the first fucking attack is just like shit <laughs> Oh, I thought I was dead! I was very concerned when it zoomed out. <laughs> what? Oh you just God. lightly poked him! Oh, just a little, I mean, it was a, you know, it was a jumping thrust. It was, it was... Well done, Thank you, you killed him. Thank you, Cotton. I like that you're our hunting horn user now. Thanks for the support. You know, you've always had the skills on a Kentos. So it is true. <laughs> God damn. He's got a tall fang. Did you know that? We really need to stop stabbing each other in the thigh, though. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure we're really getting many materials. He's a very intense boy. He's a tough one, yeah. The defense down and then all the damage. Like, it's a good it's a good combo. Good thing we had adamant seeds this time. We were prepared. Adamantly prepared. That's so smooth. How are you doing that so smooth? Just, just spin. You just, you just spin. It's easy. God, who polished that floor? Because they did a bang-up job. My word. It's me, actually, by doing this. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh, the other way now. Oh! Good spins. Good spins, dude. Good spins, man. Really cool spins. <laughs>
And with that, ladies and gentlemen, Antwerp. we start our path towards the urgent quest that will reward us with Girank. <laughs> the other urgent quests, not urgent quests. <coughs> the other key quests to unlock it are monsters in in World and Iceborne and Rise and Sunbreak. So we'll we'll give them a good old gentle spanking, or at least I will. I'll give it a gentle glorping. Support me from the sidelines. And Glorp. then, well, it gets good. It gets gooey. It gets good and gooey. That's the other fourth gen game. That is the other four. Monster Hunter, good and gooey. Mm, the expansion to the expansion. All right, guys. Like if you enjoyed this. Subscribe and hit the bell for more. And until we meet again. A good Good glorp. Josh, Cotton, and Hollow with the videos Dropping the humor like a hammer on your tippy toes Bringing entertainment on a daily arrangement To take our insanity and turn it into entertainment Yes, I said entertainment twice To reiterate that it is nice To look into your faces on a mostly daily basis When you let us in your homes to make the whole world a stage Is, uh, goodbye